Welcome. In this Revit tutorial, I will be showing you how to create and apply view filters to your view. Here we have the advanced uh, sample project uh, that comes with Revit. And what we're going to do is essentially create an emergency lighting plan using the lighting plan uh, currently existing. Uh, so what we're going to do is we duplicated the types that are emergency lights and we named the type uh, emergency lights. Also the wires that are for the emergency circuits we duplicated the type and we named that type emergency circuits. So in order to create view filters we're going to come to visibility graphics and we're going to go to the filter section. You can also create new filters uh, via the filters button right there. Uh, so we're going to do is we're going to hit edit and new and then we're going to create a new filter. This one is going to be called non-emergency lights. Uh, the category that is this filter is going to affect is going to be our light fixtures. And the way we want this filter to work is since we named our fixtures that we want to keep as emergency fixtures we're going to choose type name and we're going to say anything that is not an emergency light this filter is going to affect so we'll hit OK and create the filter now we have to add this filter to our view so we'll hit add and when we find it where is that? there it is we'll select our non-emergency lights so right now this filter is saying our non-emergency lights are visible. So if we'll uncheck our visibility, we'll hit OK, and it turns off all light fixtures that are not of the type emergency lights. Now we're going to turn off all, fix all line wires that are of not emergency circuit type. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go to filters. We're going to create a new filter. And we're going to call them non-emergency wires. This time, the category is going to be wires. And it's going to be basically the same filter. We're going to do type name. It does not equal. And we're going to say emergency circuits add that filter to our view we're going to turn off the visibility and that hides all the wires that are not for the emergency circuit now what we can also do is we can create a filter to override the line type uh, of our emergency circuit so we can show them as um, dashes or whatever type of line you want. So we're going to create another new filter and then we're going to call this one emergency wire override. And for this one it's also going to affect our wires and we want this one to only affect our emergency circuits. So we're going to leave it to say equals this time. We're going to add that filter to our list of filters that are applied to this view. And we're going to pick right here. It, when you click on it, it'll pop up and let you hit the override button. And this is where we can override the pattern of the line. So we'll use the double dash in this instance. Hit OK. And we want this override to be visible, so we'll leave visibility checked. When we hit OK, it shows up as a double dash line. This works great for your lighting plan, too. If you just want to have just the emergency circuit shown differently, you can just have that also apply, and it won't affect all your other wires. 
Well, I hope this uh, tutorial was informative, uh, at least to get you introduced to creating new filters and how to apply them to your view. Uh, thank you very much.